Installing the Eero can be completed in less than 30 minutes. Before you get started, unpack the contents of the box, which include install guide, power adapter, screws, front panel, and wall mount. To get started, you'll need a Phillips head screwdriver and an iOS or Android smartphone or tablet. If you are mounting the Eero to drywall, you will also want an electric drill, drill bit, and a hammer. You are now ready to start the hardware installation. Check the Wi-Fi at your current controller's location. To do this, connect your local network on your smartphone or tablet and observe the network strength while standing next to your controller. Manually run your sprinklers to ensure your system is functioning properly. If a zone isn't operational, take note and make sure to repair any related issues. Unplug your old controller. For reference, take a picture of your wiring setup on your old timer before you remove any wires. Label important wires on the old timer. Important wires include common, master or pump valve, and any sensors. Once the wires are labeled, go ahead and remove them. Remove the old controller. To remove your timer, look for screws or mounting brackets that connect it to the wall. Be careful not to damage your wall in the process. Attach the wall mount. Before you secure the wall plate to the wall, snake your wires into the terminal area using one of two holes, either on the back or bottom of the wall plate. Once you've routed the wires into the wall plate, attach it to the wall using the hardware provided. Reattach the wires. Common wires attached to the white terminal slots, master valve or pump valve wires attached to the blue terminal slot, sensor wires attached to the yellow terminal slots, zone wires attached to the green terminal slots. Refer to your wiring picture if necessary. Next, we will go over how to pair your Eero to Wi-Fi using BlinkUp. Download the app from the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. The app will lead you step-by-step -step through the registration and setup of your Eero. Now let's register your Ratio account. You'll need to enter your full name, email, username, and password. Name your Eero. Henry is a good name, or maybe Susan. You will also need to enter the zip code where the device will be housed. Plug in your Eero. There are three indicators on the upper right-hand corner of your Eero. They include power, Wi-Fi, and status. Verify your smartphone is connected to your local network via Wi-Fi. Double-check that the listed network is the one you want to pair your Eero to. If you do not know your password, please retrieve it as it is required for the BlinkUp. Next, you will follow the steps in the app to connect to Wi-Fi using BlinkUp. After reviewing the instructions in the app, press the green button on the screen. Place your phone screen over the photo sensor in the bottom left hand of the Eero. Following BlinkUp, the Wi-Fi status light will flash green quickly to confirm it captured the BlinkUp code from your mobile device. Once complete, you should get one of two screens a successful blink-up, or a failure to connect to Wi-Fi. If successful, your Eero's Wi-Fi signal will blink green for one hour, after which time it will turn off. If you did not get a successful blink-up, please follow the instructions on the app to attempt a second blink-up. If problems further persist, please contact Ratio Support. Lastly, connect the front panel to the wall mount. Congratulations! Your Ratio Eero is now fully installed. Next, you'll want to configure your zones and schedules from the app. 